As the enforcement directorate heat intensifies on Vivo, the firm's India's directors were not found during searches. These are the directors of the distributors of Vivo and they are suspected to have left the country. It's also alleged that Chinese nationals Zhen Shenu and Zhang Ji misrepresented their identities on the documents. Let's go across to Bhavtosh joining us for more on this. Bhavtosh, with the ED news now tightening, these directors seem to be missing. What more details can you share with us? Uh, Rohit, uh, yesterday uh, China, uh, China had issued a statement claiming that there should not be any witch hunt uh, even as India uh, carried out its own investigation. Remember, uh, two days back, Enforcement Directorate carried out its investigation and uh, uh, searches were carried out at at least 44 locations spread uh, across the country. Now, ED has said that they had registered a case of money laundering on basis of an FI that was filed by the Economic Offensive. Uh, Grand Prosp uh, Prospects uh, is a company that was one of the biggest distribu uh, distributors of uh, Vivo. Uh, this company has an office uh, in Solon. Now, when the Enforcement Directorate and other agencies carried out its own investigation, they found that two uh, Chinese distributors of this company uh, had misrepresented uh, their identity. And uh, when searches were carried out, they could not be found in India. Now, it's being suspected that... Uh, it could be possible that they have fled uh, via uh, land route to uh, uh, to Nepal and then from Nepal they could have fled to China. Uh, another director of this company, a Chinese national, uh, Hunt is on to find him. Uh, there is another uh, company, another distribu uh, distribution company of uh, Vivo. Uh, that uh, company is also under the scanner of uh, the enforcement directorate. Uh, ED has also said that sister concern as well as subsidiaries of Vivo are also under the scanner. Remember, Vivo has probably uh, uh, around 30% of share of uh, mobile phone and, and other uh, other uh, electronic equipment. And they suspect that the in guise of uh, giving royalty payments uh, to, uh, to the parent company, money could have been diverted abroad. Now, when the income tax last December carried out rates and searches, they pegged the figure at around 5,000 crore rupees. But ED suspect that the money could be much more than that. And that's the reason why the investigation has now gathered uh, steam. All right, Bhavtosh, thanks very much for joining us with those details.